Mavericks. Ward at the tap. Ward had to be careful if he's going to take possession. That's a little more standing. You can see how slippery and difficult it is, but not too difficult. Ben Keys. Tremendous. This is score review. Score confirmed. You can restart play. Right. They, they didn't overturn it. They didn't overturn it. Out to the wing. Barry getting a full game, which is a bit of a rarity for him. Fogarty has to fly the pack. Here he is. And again. here it is. He's already looming as the biggest star. And this time, Keys. Oh, I tell you what. <laughs> and for a second goal, this one a little more certain than the last. Ben Keys and the Adelaide Crows. Five scores to nothing. And some flow forward. At full stride, Callahan a bounce. And then a kick to Isaac Cumming, who should and does. As we said, Isaac coming back in the team tonight. His first game of the season and his first goal is a welcome sight for the Giants. And we all jump to attention because the Giants are going. Bedford to half forward. Grashevsky, who kicked two goals on debut last week. This would take Cummings a mighty out. blast. He had his choice, didn't he? Inside 50. He's still got Cummings out. Yeah. The semblance of uh, the tsunami. He's had a goal kicking to his prowess in the past two years, Josh Kelly. Oh, good tap. And a fancy tap. Awesome tap. High kick from Brent Daniels. Up and under to full forward, Riccardi! Gone 1 0 2 in the past three weeks. Jake Riccardi, but he's off and running with a goal. Going to be split open, but it's a clever comeback. Another opportunity for Kelly. Threads the handball. Daniels into the square. Riccardi could have kicked his second, but Jesse needs one, and he puts it through. Happy to oblige. <laughs> Got the splash. Got under the covers. Toby Green takes it. We've seen that a bit over the years. Straight, tap. straight onto the boot. Straight through. In opposition jumpers. Oh, hinge kicks long. Oh, well done. Casually sticks out the left palm. And Rankin's close enough to do some serious damage. And he takes oh, the mark. <laughs> he had to make it as difficult as possible. Adelaide need it. They need him. He steps forward. Heads down towards full forward as Fogarty and Walker both make their move up to the footy. He set shots have actually dropped away this year, but there's nothing wrong with that. Free kick to Murphy, who takes his own advantage. Kicks it deep. Fogarty's got away from Allaire again, and he takes the mark of the pocket. You talked about it earlier, Dan. Get this time Fogarty gets it right and it does get in off the left. Kiltev's opportunity there, knocked away by Himmelberg, but the danger was still apparent. The handballs ended with Rochelle. And he is delighted and so are the Crows. That's four on end. And they dodge one there though, the Giants, don't they? The lead is 15. Oh, great mark. It's looked like it's going to expand and it still might. O'Brien towards Walker. They're in sync that time. Imagine okay, Taylor okay. Here he Chappie. goes. He waits for no one. There's no one in the goal square. Unguarded. Did it clip the post? It didn't. It's a goal. Big issues at the moment. Oh, Rankin. Again, an unguarded goal square. And again, the Crows take full toll. What a night this could be. His feet were fancy enough to get him away there. The kick goes to the wing, but it's Adelaide with all the answers He's to lifted. any question you want to pose at the moment. O'Brien's lifted. Off to Cook. Here they come again to full forward. Fogarty, perfect vantage point. Pulls down another mark. Well, they had control of the footy for a few minutes, but uh, unable to get a goal. Hogan might change that. No, but... Knocks it away. Again, Cornelio went through a couple of options. Settles on Kelly, who might finally have enough on the kick. And at last, it's a Giants goal. This year, in comparison to last year, where they were just incredible. Oh, some strange handball choices there on the way out. And they break down again. Barry will get another shot for Shelley if he wants to. A couple of spots they need to fill, but they're looking pretty sharp tonight. Takes the set snap. Tries the left boot on for size. How about that? That's a goal. McMullen, he can fling this at goal. He too decides to defer. Back to Toby Green. Further back. Now Ward with a go-ahead kick at goal and in goal. Where his man was, Thomas, sets up Bedford, who kept his eyes only on the footy. Suddenly things just look a little better. Daniels to the square and Riccardi. 
Callahan. They get his four crows there. They're going to need each other's way. Hogan was ready and waiting, and so was Toby Green. Careful left foot kick. Line board. Bounces Toby's way and goes through. Well, Dowling. Consistent. Buckley fell over. Left Walker on his own. Oh, Dawson. Oh. His aerial prowess comes to the fore. He's clean kicking towards full forward. Fogarty. Shoal. Got it. Ward. Perryman. Whole host of crows, but Hogan! He simply must convert Jesse Hogan. And he does! That's furthest from his mind. Dawson is really up the ante for the crows with his marking and long kicking eye. And look at flashing through it was Murphy. Over to Keys. One more. Fogarty. Yep. They needed an answer, and I'd say that qualifies as an immediate one. Dowling closes, tries to put some doubt, but he's done pretty well earlier. Here's Hamelow, takes the mark, fielding offers, handball Saligo right in front of his face. And he's leading into the pocket, it's Billy Dowling. And it would be even bigger if he can slot this with all the pressure that was on everyone. It's the teenager that shows them how to do it. 38 touches for uh, Green, he's yeah. worked his backside he off his work up. To no avail though as far as the W is concerned, unless... Yeah. But Kelly's out to his right already. No one's been able to kick a 55 metre goal, but then no one is Toby Green! There's no one like him. They have had to ward off the Giants, but they can enjoy this siren! The sounds of victory!